Indictments on nearly a dozen charges filed in the case of a man police say was behind the wheel when he ran a red light, hitting another SUV, killing a family of three in Garner. 25-year-old Jordan Porter is now facing three counts of second-degree murder. CBS 17's Hilly Fixler has been following this story. She's live now breaking down the new details we are uncovering from court documents. Hilly, what can you tell us? Porter is facing 11 charges after this deadly Memorial Day crash. Investigators say he was speeding, driving recklessly, and was impaired with alcohol and marijuana. 28-year-old Tyler Campbell, 29-year-old Susie Campbell, and their son, 8-year-old Miles Campbell, all killed in a crash in Garner on Memorial Day. Investigators say 25-year-old Jordan Porter is to blame. A grand jury indicted him Tuesday on 11 charges, including three counts of felony death by vehicle, three counts of second-degree murder, speeding, possession of marijuana paraphernalia, failing to stop at a red light, and transporting an open container of an alcoholic beverage after consuming alcohol. These court documents show Porter's wife, Shelby, told investigators her husband had two to three beers and smoked marijuana before leaving that afternoon. She is also reported to have said the Chevy Trailblazer he was driving needed repair work and the brakes and the steering wheel had problems. There had not been a safety inspection on the car since February 2020. Investigators also noted CBS 17 showed this video of the scene where Shelby Porter is entering the Chevy. They believe she may have removed or tampered with additional evidence. And as we've reported before, Porter had over 10 driving-related charges in the past, and most of them had been dismissed. We are continuing to work to get you some more information, so stick with us right here on CBS 17. Live in Raleigh, Haley Fixler, CBS 17 News. All right, Haley, thank you for the update.